Hey guys, it's Desiree. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be showing you how I do my everyday makeup. Before I start my makeup, I always apply a moisturizer to my entire face. I use the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Gel Cream and I love this moisturizer because it never dries out my skin and it creates a great base for my makeup. Next, I use the Sycopare Tiger Grass Color Correcting Treatment by Dr. Jart. It starts off as a green color, but when you rub it in, it turns into a beige super light coverage formula. Even though I don't have super red toned skin, I like how this product evens out my skin tone without feeling like I have makeup caked onto my face, and it also soothes any irritation. Now on to brows. I use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz in the shade Soft Brown. I start by lining up the pencil with the bridge of my nose and making a dash at the front of my brow where it should start. And then I begin filling in my brows with short strokes to mimic actual hairs because my brows are very sparse naturally. I use the brow pencil every day so I go through it pretty quickly, but it's honestly my favorite product. I feel like for brow pencils, higher priced items tend to have better color payoff and tend to produce colors that match your brows closer. Then I go in with my Ulta Beauty Brow Pomade and swipe that through my brows quickly to add some dimension and fill in any areas I missed with the pencil. Finally, I go in with the Ulta Brow Expert palette in light and I mix the two powder shades and continue to fill in my brows.
Next, I go in with the NARS Radiant Concealer and apply a small amount on my under eyes, around the bridge of my nose, and on top of my nose. I absolutely love this concealer because it looks so natural and light on my skin. It matches the color of my skin so perfectly, but it still covers up dark circles super well. I just use my finger to rub this product in. I used to use a beauty blender in the past, but I find that with this concealer, my finger blends it just as well. Then I set the concealer with the Laura Mercier translucent powder. I lightly sweep the powder over the concealer to prevent creasing and to make it last longer. Now onto eyelashes. I start by curling my eyelashes a lot. I have very straight lashes, but I think the curled lashes are so much more flattering, so I spend kind of a lot of time making sure that I have the perfect curl before continuing on to mascara. I use the Clinique High Impact Waterproof Mascara, which I absolutely love. It's so natural looking and it lengthens and volumizes my lashes at the same time without leaving a bunch of clumps. I usually do one coat and if I have time, I'll add another one or two. For my bottom lashes, I use the Pixi by Petra Lower Lash Mascara. I love how the wand is super thin and the formula is very light so it never gets smudges on my lower lash line. And for the final touch, I love adding highlighter, especially in the summer. Since I don't put any foundation or BB cream on my skin, I feel like highlight adds an extra pop and makes my skin look super good. I will usually start with my Sonia Kashuk Highlight Stick and then layer over the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Powder in Luminous Light. And I apply highlight to all the high parts of my face, especially my nose and above my cheekbones. And we're done! If you like this video and want to see more like it, please hit the subscribe button down below and check me out on my social media platforms. Bye!